All right, everybody, welcome to my collection of Mavericks, which is, of course, the Whiteout Blaster, which you just saw. Uh, I absolutely love this gun still. Um, so this is my one being one of my uh, Mavericks I'm going to probably use in a future war Nerf War or whatever. That's just safe just to lay it down on the side with the new version I wear. Um, of course, I do have some standard blasters as well. This is, which one is this? Ah, this is my extreme modded blaster. It's got penny mod, air shifter removal, dead air space removal. Um, so this is just a full barrel drop, you know, standard stuff. It's loaded with everything I got, but however, it's not an original Maverick. It's you color, color is off. It's not the same blaster. It also gets a little bit weaker ranges. Which is a, it's a brand new one, but it's also one of the older, it's not one of the older ones, that is still really good. Now, here is one of my older ones, which I was able to get a hold of, actually I was able to get a hold of a couple of them. This one is, which one is this one? Ah, this is the completely still stock one. Um, which is great, because I'm still not really sure what I'm going to do with that one. Here's the um, uh, full modded one. Oh. I don't like my darts flying everywhere. Yeah, it doesn't have full barrel drop done yet. Uh, I'm not sure why I didn't do that. Probably for good reason. Anyway, this is my other full fully modded Maverick. Okay, mistake. And here is my signature blasters, as you can see. The, basically, what I did to them is I completely switched out the barrels. And to do that, I actually switched out the plastic tab to hold the barrels. I also switched out the um, plastic tabs here for unlocking the drum. And back here is also switched out as well. I am considering maybe painting this part black along with this outer piece right here and painting that little, tiny little bit right there bright orange, but I'm still debating. This one is my personal favorite because of the look, the feel. So between these two, I do like the whiteout more, but I gotta say this is one of my proudest the mods, even though it's so simple. Um, I did have to add a little bit of foam up here at the front. Otherwise, the um, uh, barrel wouldn't sit back far enough to get a good seal. So that's what that is. These are, if I remember, if you ever see a Nerf War, and uh, you see somebody dual wielding a pair of these, most likely it'll be me. Because these will be most likely my dual wield weapons. Because uh, I do like these a lot. I definitely need to pull the air shifter for the, from this one. It's uh, still getting not that great ranges, and for some reason, darts don't like to come out. I'm also going to be coming up, I'm going to be doing a 7, 17 30 seconds interior barrel mod for a Maverick. Uh, I know it's kind of weird, but a lot of people do PVC, but I want to do a 17 30 seconds because I still want to be able to fire Whistler darts as well as streamlines. So I'm kind of hoping I can get that done. Now, time for my ultimate Maverick. Come on. Come on. You saw this once before on my full barrel drop. But now I'm going to show you a little more. This part here is the main gun. This is just the stock reinforced, which you can click on this if you want to go see how I did that. So as you can see, it's, uh, it's part of a recon, and it's also uh, a Maverick up here with a small rubber band. Don't ask me why. But I don't want it. This, this gun alone deserves its complete own review because I love this gun. I'm glad I made it. I just wish I could have made it better. I mean, I made this in a rush job. I made this in about anywhere from 8 to 10 hours using nothing more than chopsticks, hot glue, cardboard, and a bunch of miscellaneous pieces I just had lying around. I love this gun. I just wish I could build it better. What it is essentially is the front gun that completely responds to everything back here. So I can fire it. I can still not reload. That was a little pathetic, anyway. But the reason why I did this is because, secretly, this gun can actually shoot around corners. 
yeah, you're thinking the gun can shoot around corners, big deal. I've made it, based it off a corner shot. If you guys want to see a video for this, please click this and let me know. Or just leave me a comment down below because I probably won't get around to making it for a while. Just If you guys want to see exactly what I did to this, how I did it, I'm going to have to build another one from scratch. But if you guys want to see this, that's fine. If not, that's okay. Anyway, give me a thumbs up if you think my collection's cool. Don't give me a thumbs down, please. I, that's just plain rude. Um, so just let me know. Is there any specific Maverick you want to know more about? Uh, get back to me and then see you around, Nerf.